for anyone but Jesus. You can't put your whole weight, praise God, on all your cares, praise God, for anyone but Jesus. Resting on and trusting in Him and Him only. We can trust God when we can't trust nobody else. Why? Because God is the one that knows all about it. He knows when we're up. He knows when we're down. He knows our down standing. He knows our thoughts are far off. Praise God. He's God. And if there is no other, praise God. He's the only one that you can depend on. Praise God. Hallelujah. That won't let you down. That won't withdraw. That won't reject you. He'll be with you, but he'll deal with us. Oh, yes. He's a God that will deal with us. Praise God. And we thank God, too. Praise God for God in the heavenly host. And we also thank God for God's people, those that he was strategically put in our lives. Praise God by the will. Hallelujah. Praise God that we can trust the God in them. Don't trust them. Hallelujah. Don't trust me in this flesh. Trust God. Amen. With all of our hearts. He is the better judge. Hallelujah. We can't judge nothing. Judge nothing in life. Praise God. He's the best judge of what we need. Praise God. And even of our want. Hallelujah. We must not be wise in our own eyes. As the scripture said, hallelujah, but acknowledge him in all of our ways, praise God, is to give everything over unto him. Amen. It's a learning way, but we have to give it all over to him, praise God. Now, it's not that we have not done these things, but there may be some places in our lives where we have uh, restricted him. Yes, yes. Can we do that? Oh, yes. We can restrict God according to our way, praise God, and allow, not, not allow him to have the influence that he should have in every area of our life. We give over some ways, but we don't give over all the way. But the word of God says what? Trust in the Lord what? With all thy heart, all thy mind, all thy soul, all thy strength. And you can't, you can't do that unless you first know who he is. We got to know who he is. Do we know him who he is in all totality of who he is? No. But we should go on to know. The Bible says and go on to know him. You can't lean up on someone you don't know. You can't trust somebody you don't know. You can't give everything over and your whole weight of your life on a person, place, and thing if you don't know. Now, what better person to get over to? Then Jesus Christ. Then the song says, get to know him. Get to know him. He is somebody you need to know. Get to know him. Get to know him. He is somebody you need to know. Hallelujah. It's just more than the religiosity of what we do. Y'all, we got to know him. For ourselves, not know him through somebody. Thank God that he comes through. He helps us. He supports us through one another. We need one another. We understand that. Hallelujah. The Bible declares it. How do we been had by blessings to others? People have been blessed by us through Christ. Not about us. Hallelujah. We can't do nothing of our own. We don't even know to do nothing right of our own. It takes Christ. It takes the righteousness of Jesus Christ. Through our lives. Because why? He's the one that made us righteous. He's the one put on. He said, put on righteousness. He's the one put it on us. Mm -hmm. Hallelujah. And now we're yet learning how to operate in the righteousness of God. Stand in right standing with him and his word. Amen. Praise God. God is good. Let's go to um, Psalm 37. Hallelujah. 1 and 5. One through five. Do not pray because of those who are evil or envious. We got it. It's in you, Lord, remember that I trust. Of those who do wrong. For like the grass, they soon wither. Like green plants, they will soon die away. Trust in the Lord. Trust in the Lord and do good. When you trust in the Lord, then he expects us to do what? Good. Amen. James 4, 17 lets us know to know to do what's right and not to do it is sin. That's just it. It doesn't, it doesn't have anything to do with our anointing, our positioning God, all the, all the titles that we have. Hallelujah. Praise God. To know to do what's right and not to do it is sin. Amen. Amen. Um, trust in the Lord and do good. Dwell in the land and enjoy safe pasture. When we trust in the Lord, we can dwell in the land. 
saying, praise God. We can enjoy, praise God, Jesus. Take the light in the Lord, and he will give you the desires of your heart. Praise God. It is in you, Lord, that I trust. And when you trust in somebody like him, my God, you can take the light, y'all. You can take, when you're delighting something to someone, you're taking pleasure in them. Uh, um, uh, you're taking joy in them. My God, my God. And if we're doing that with God, we should be able to do that with one another. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Yes, it is so. Hallelujah. And then it goes on to say in the fifth verse, commit your way to the Lord, trust in him, and he will do this. He will make your righteous reward shine like the dawn. Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah, Lord, it is in you that I trust. Not so much that I can get things, not that, that we can get things and gimme, 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 all like that. He's going to do what he does because that's who he is. But we ought to trust in him just because of who he is, not what we want him to do for us. Mm-hmm. You know how it is when a parent, parent, praise God, hallelujah, and covenant parents, praise God, hallelujah, your child. You know, your child comes to you all the time, mommy, daddy, mommy, daddy, mommy, gimme, 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 gimme. And after a while, you're going to look, because I've done the same thing. And I, I, I often wonder, and I even asked the question at one time, do you love me just for who I am? Because, see, who I am, I got flaws, see. Praise God, hallelujah. But I ain't got no flaws when you want something. Mm. Lord, have mercy, Jesus. God ain't got no flaws. But we still don't want to come to him and rub in his belly about gimme, gimme, gimme. He wants to trust him because we love him. Mm-hmm. When you love somebody, you can trust him. Mm-hmm. I mean, when you truly love him mm-hmm. with no observation. Hallelujah. That takes growing to God, y'all. That takes growing to spiritual growth and maturity. We don't start off like that. Mm-hmm. Hallelujah. You have to grow into that. And you have to grow, into, grow with God as well as what? Grow with one another. And then that trust begins to build up, praise God. Hallelujah. We thank God for that. Amen. The fifth verse, commit your way to the Lord, trust in him, and he will do this. He will make your righteous reward shine like the dawn, your vindication like the noonday sun. Lord, have mercy. And while we're trusting him, it goes on to say in the seventh verse, be still before the Lord and wait patiently for him. Now, when you love somebody, you can wait on them. Yeah, God may not come. We know the song, he may not come when we want him, but he'll be right on time. And we sing that song, but you know sometimes we be spastic. Sometimes we just be all, all out of sorts. Mm-hmm. Some we're yet growing, say, we're growing. Yeah. Some may already be there, but some are still yet growing. Hallelujah. So we got to keep trusting the Lord for one another. Praise God. And that you've been converted in the turn around and strengthen somebody else, but you got to want to be strengthened, though. Mm-hmm. You got to want to be strengthened. You got to want to see yourself. Got to want to be exposed. Because one thing about it, God will expose us to ourselves first before He exposes us to everybody else. Amen. Yeah, He will. I'm a witness to that. Mm-hmm. Praise God. So while we're waiting, while we're trusting Him, we got to wait patiently for Him and do not fret when people succeed in their ways, mm-hmm. when they carry out their wicked schemes. Refrain from anger. Oh, I, it, is you, it is in you, Lord, that I trust. Yes, we can anger, but do we don't want to sin with that anger. And we don't want our, the sun, hallelujah, to go down on our anger. Because you don't know if you're going to wake up the next morning. And then if you do wake up, you don't know if your face is going to be on the side of your face. You, anger does a whole lot to our body. Anger, that ball and anger, we're not going to have that, y'all. Not when we're waiting and trusting on the Lord. Refrain from anger and turn from wrath. Do not fret. It only leads to evil. As soon as we start fretting, you better be assured that evil is right around the corner. Try to influence us to do evil because we're fretting. This don't go right. So I got to go ahead of it and try to fix it. And God didn't say try to fix it. He said what? Entrust it unto me. When you trust somebody, you can't do what now? Entrust all of your cares. Everything about what's going on to him because he's the only one you can trust. It depends on whose hands you're putting yourself into. But I encourage you, as I'm encouraged this morning, put everything into the hands of the Lord. Amen, amen. For those who are evil will be destroyed. If, if we do evil, praise God, if we found that way, we're going to be destroyed. But those who do what? Hope in the Lord will do what? Inherit the land. Oh, yes, y'all. 
I'm going to magnify you. I'm going to glorify you. 